Crypto.js is one of those external libraries which is built into the Postman sandbox. This library is used for encryption and decryption of data within your pre-request or test script. Let's create an API request where we will be using AES method for encryption and decryption of data. In this API request, we will be using a URL to post the encrypted message, a pre-request script that will help us create an encrypted message using a passphrase and a test script to decrypt the message. Let's add an API request that I will name Eco API. Now that we have created an API, let's write a pre-request script where let message be super secret here. and passphrase be my password. Since we will be using the passphrase in both encryption and decryption, let's make it a collection variable so that we can use it extensively. To encrypt the message, we will be using CryptoJS AES encrypt function. Now that we are done with pre-request script, let's add a console log so that we can log the result to postman's console and parallelly we will post the data to api using postman's request add query param now that we are done with the pre request script let's hit the send button and check the message and encrypted data as you can see, the raw message has been encrypted successfully. Similarly, let's decrypt the message and log it to the postman's console using test script. Here, we will get the data or encrypted message from the API response using pm.response.json and a passphrase from a collection variable that we have already set. To decrypt the message, we will be using AES decrypt function. And we will log the result to Postman's console. Now that we are done with the test script as well, let's hit the send button and check whether the message that we have sent over the API has been properly decrypted or not. As you can see, the raw message that we have sent has been encrypted and posted over the URL of API request. And in response, we have decrypted the same in our test script. Similarly, this library helps us to encrypt and decrypt the data. And there are similar multiple encryption methods supported by this library. To make it convenient and useful, Postman has already created a collection with examples of more than 20 encryption methods. The collection link is in the description which can be forked and used with your API request.